There's the whistle, and away we go from Children's Mercy Park. Sporting going from right to left, dressed in their blue-on-blue -blue hoops. Minnesota United dressed in the black-on-black. Eric Tommy drives this one in. It, by, it finds his way to Fontas. His shot was blocked. Espinosa's able to keep it in. Chips it to the six. Agata denied by St. Clair, and it's bundled behind. Who touched it last? It's a corner. Actually, it comes across. Fontas hits that really well, actually. Mr. Espinosa does a good job just keeping this play alive. We got a snap header. Tain St. Clair, though, talked about it in the pregame. He can win games for Minnesota United. He has, in the past, very good goal. Trying to play Amaria into space. See Martin it in. Being forced to show his pace to recover here. Amaria. Saved by Polskamp. A relatively comfortable one in the end. Johnny Russell into the penalty area. Toward the byline he goes. Try to test the keeper and it's bundled home. A wry smile from Johnny Russell. It'll go down as an own goal against Minnesota United. It's a good 1v1 play from Johnny Russell. Roger Espinosa finds him. Our Lords just had a good tackle in on Johnny Russell right here. Johnny Russell goes with his right foot. That is unlucky for Boxel. Didn't know anything about that. St. Clair makes the first save. Right off of Boxel and in. Good job from Daniel Shallowy to help it on to Tom. He's got a full head of steam. It's the turn on Boxel. He's got the goalkeeper out. St. Clair making himself big. Here's Tommy picking it up in a half space. Finds Espinoza. Now Russell, first time hit. Bangs it off the post. Russell tracks it down. Now Tommy will have a go, fakes the shot, fires it in! Oh, Tommy boy! What a goal this is from Sporting Kansas City. The first one, Johnny Russell does everything right, just hits off the post, stays with it though, what a fake from Eric Tommy and hits this one with his left foot. Look at the movement on this one. Will Trap flies right on by. Eric Tommy right through Shallowy and Agata. Dane St. Clair can't see it. Slicing away from him. What a goal and what a build up to this goal. Eric Tommy puts Sporting Kansas City up 2-0 here. Assists credited to his name because he's been involved just about every goal has been scored when he's out on the field. And Sweat on the left-hand side again. And he finds Agata, who powers it home! This is domination in Children's Mercy Park! And look who it is. Been singing his praises all night. Ben Sweat, again. Easy ball in. Willie Agata, so brave to go up and win this one for Dane St. Clair. Gets his timing wrong. Willie Agata tucks this one in. What a ball again from Ben Sweat. He's really found his form, and Sporting Kansas City are all over Minnesota United. Some more playing time if he strings together some performances like that. Second half is underway at Children's Mercy Park. Sporting Kansas City now have outscored Minnesota United at Children's Mercy Park in regular season games through six and a half games, 18 to one. Kate Pierre tried to play it back to Fontas, but inadvertently puts it into the path of Amaria. Amaria! Wide of the target. Bulleter to Shallowy to Tommy.
Back to Shallowy. Parried away. Rebound shot over the bar by Agata. Again, though, the sequence of play and the pattern play for Sporting is perfect. It, it's perfect. Bulleter into Shallowy. Good. Tommy Shallowy and Sweat operating the left half of the field for Sporting KC. They really combined well. Here's a volley shot that snuck past the keeper and in by Garcia. Well, against the run of play, I actually have to say Minnesota has been on the front foot here to open up the second half. Half volley to keep Minnesota in this game. That's a good little ball. In behind the defense, Kamar Lawrence, what a finish. This is from Mender Garcia, who slides that one near post. And the defenders on that Minnesota side are paying Shallowy and Tommy some good respect as well. Sagging off him. Look at all this space for Shallowy here. He'll pull the trigger. Bounces into the arms of St. Clair. Good hold. Good hold from St. Clair. Shallowy. Well, he was trying to find Johnny Russell and his own teammate, Willie Agata, got in the way. Tommy wins it back on the tackle, though. Back across by Shallowy. And this one slotted in by Agata. A birthday brace for Willie Agata. And the three-goal advantage is restored. This is because Eric Tommy wins that ball, gets a deflection. Shallowy does a great job staying with the play, gets his head up. Perfect ball across. Willie Agata makes the right run in this moment, slots it past St. Clair. 4-1, sporting Kansas City. Exactly the goal that they needed. And there is the final whistle. The incredible run of form of Sporting Kansas City in the late summer continues.